Yo, what's going on? It's your boy, Mr. Locario, the bad boy of the dating game. What's popping? So, you know, I was getting uh, emails and people were sending me information on um, Dr. Umar Johnson uh, fucking with some strippers or something like that. Like, they, they had these screenshots of him conversing with some stripper and then the stripper, I guess, exposed him or something. But this is the thing. First, before I even say anything about this. A lot of this shit looks ridiculous. It, it, it looks like it's fake bullshit. Like, I don't even know if it's real. So, you know, this could be some some rumor, some shit to try to set him up. You understand? And if, if you don't know who Dr. Umar Johnson is, you know, just Google. You'll, you'll see, he, you know, he's on his pro-black stuff. I like a lot of the stuff he says, you know. But, um, the thing is this, man. What I gotta say about it is this. I don't understand specifically what the problem is you understand like the only problem i have with it is you know the stuff that i was reading seemed a little bit like on some simping type shit that's that's the only problem i have with it you understand but you know people all over the internet right now are they're like you know talking shit about it and they're like oh you know how could he do this and he's he's supposed to be this this leader of black people and all this other stuff and I'm like okay cool but what does that have to do with him you know trying to get his rocks off I don't I don't I don't, I don't see what the what the big deal is you understand and you know the, the thing that people forget about this guy and people like him and people who are in the public eye but specifically a person like him is that they forgot that Dr. Umar Johnson is this three-letter word, and I, I don't like to say this three-letter word in public because it seems like it's becoming illegal to be a person who is this three-letter word. And what this three-letter word is, is Dr. Umar Johnson is a man. He's a man. Okay, I know it's, I know it's not right to, to speak of such things, but he is a man. And, you know, men... And I don't know if any of you guys heard this, but there's a rumor going around that men like to have sex with women. Right? Exactly. So my, my question is, why is this even an issue? That's my question. That's what I would like to know. You have a man who's trying to get sex from a woman. Now, you know, that woman is a stripper or whatever, you know, then that's up to you to, you know, your opinion of, you know, should... Should guys be trying to smash strippers? That's a whole nother thing. You know, but the dude is a man. What do you, what do you, what do you expect? Now, you know, this could have been a story or this could have been like some, some interesting news if, let's say he was trying to fuck a, a white stripper. You know, I, I seen that, uh, you know, cause I know that Umar Johnson's not, not, you know, he's not with the interracial dating. He's not about that life. That's. That's what I've heard from him. I could be wrong. His his stance could have changed on that. You know, if it was a, if it was a white chick, then I can understand people like, yo, but you talking about this pro black stuff and you trying to fuck white strippers? Like, I can understand that. But the chick, from my knowledge, what I saw, it was, it was a black chick. You understand? So you got a pro black dude trying to get some buns from a woman. I don't see what is the big deal. Seriously, like. Tell me something I don't know, guys. I mean, what, I don't, I don't see what the problem is. Again, my problem is, you know, the whole trying to fuck with a stripper thing. Like, I don't know. Like, like I'm not saying that it's, you know, a big deal to fuck with a stripper, but I'm sure, you know, it was getting into that uh, situation, you know, you know, of simping and tricking. Meaning, you know, let me go pay for this sex and pay for that sex and with the stripper and all this other stuff. You know, that's my only issue with it. And it, but also, you know, the other issue is that, you know, people aren't, there's a lot of people who are simple minded, who aren't that intelligent, who don't know how to think critically. So they will take what's going on and they will make it a bigger deal than it is. You understand? And so if, if this is actually real, if these texts are real and it's really him doing it, because I haven't seen him come out to address this yet, you know, <laughs> but if it's really him doing it then, you know, he has to, you know, brush up on his game a little bit and understand, like, dude, you're, you know, you're a public figure. People know you. 
and you gotta really watch out for what you put out you know put out here especially you know through text through anything that can be shown to the public you understand so you got to be careful about that and that you know that is is where the game comes in you understand this is why i tell people how important game is because you know the simple-minded folks you know all the dumb fucks out there they will try to use this against him and make it into an issue and, and have this fake outrage because he's trying to fuck with a stripper as if that's some sort of you know sin or that's some sort of crime or something like he's he wants to have sex with a stripper my god how dare you man how dare you try to have sex with a woman like you understand so that's the that's the thing that people need to understand that you know this shit is not a big deal it's not this is this is some fake nonsense and if it is fake if, if the act if the thing is actually fake and they're trying to you know frame this guy and set him up to make him look like some other thing then you know you guys i don't know what to tell you because you 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 kind of you kind of failed on that one you should have made it you should have made it to where he was uh trying to talk to some white chick or trying to get with some dude then maybe at that point we could be talking about something of substance but this ain't shit <laughs> this ain't shit and you know at, at this point it's still a rumor and I, 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 I hate to even talk on things that aren't really out there as fact because now I feel like a little gossipy bitch right now for even talking about this shit but you know people have been spreading it around people have been you know ask me what's what's what that what I think about it so this is what I think about it so um yeah let me know what you guys think and uh, click all the links below click the link to get my free ebook the magnificent 10 crucial dating tips for men so you can step up your game and also click the link below that to go to badboymembership.com so you can join my membership where you get 45 through 90 minute audio and video tutorials every month all right so I'll talk to you guys later. Remember, the truth is inside you. Peace. Hey, what's up? It's dating and life coach Mr. Locario. Go to badboymembership.com and master the dating game by joining my Bad Boy Membership program. In this program, you'll receive 45 through 90 minute, easy to follow, step by step dating advice tutorials that's guaranteed to help you attract, date, and have sex with beautiful women. Join the Bad Boy Membership today by going to badboymembership.com. That's badboymembership.com.